After a couple, three days of Sundance, when you're very tired doing the job that we do here at Park City Television, one of the things that happens is the emotions really come out. Especially when an artist brings them so close to the surface. So I just listened to Angel Taylor sing beautifully, and my emotions are really close to the surface. And uh, that's all right. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome, <laughs> Terry. Really beautiful. Um, here we are. How here was your are. Sundance? You know, just dancing away. It's been really good. 2013. Um, I love Utah, so it's, it's nice to be in Park City. Definitely. Is there such a thing, maybe it's just me because I love Los Angeles so much, but it's almost like there's a, 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 an LA light that is reflected in so many artists that <laughs> we've had here on our stage that are from Los Angeles that play and sing with a, a certain I Los would, Angeles flavor. Is there such a thing? Yeah, I would definitely agree with that. I mean, I was born and raised in LA, so I rep pretty hard. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're, they're, we are a type, I would say that. So we probably give off some sort of eccentric light of goodness. Maybe. It's totally true. <laughs> after, after hearing you and Moy Navarro <laughs> play that beautiful Jeff Buckley song. He's a, he's a fun friend to sing with. Enjoyable. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, crushing everybody for sure. Exactly. So what's the latest with your career? Um, you know, I, I've been working on some solo stuff. Um, some of that I played. Um, but I've also been doing EDM, believe it or not. So that's kind of a venture. I'm still doing solo stuff, but I'm just venturing out into the EDM world a smidge, uh, working with different producers and stuff. So been in the studio for quite some time, to, to put it lightly. <laughs> but it's fun. I love it. It's just a different avenue of music and uh, one that I'm learning and enjoying while doing so, so. Well, it occurs to me that for a long time, but in 2012, we all listen to so many different genres of totally, music. Totally, yeah. And yet, once you kind of get into the business of music, it's like you're supposed to do one thing because the more you do that, you build your brand right. and all those kind of things. So it's cool and, and fun to hear that you're doing something yeah, totally. that is just a complete fork in the road. Yeah, I mean, I think as musicians, we're so, we're so like... I don't know, we just change and we evolve like as the years go on, you know, and I feel like it would be almost impossible for even a singer-songwriter who has made a brand to not want to venture out into like EDM or country music or, you know, do a collaboration with a rapper or whatever. And that's why you see so many cool collaborations, I think, because so many artists like so many different genres of music, you know, so. Well, and certainly in a place like Los Angeles. Totally. But, but in lots of different places. People don't sort of live in camps where right. it's like, well, I'm sure you spend a lot of time at Largo and, yeah, yeah. and hang out with a lot of singer-songwriters totally. and you know them and you play with them and all that sort of thing, yeah. but especially in a, a very plural musical place like Los Angeles. Yeah, LA has so much variety as far as like musicians and genres. Like people are just, I don't know, we, we all kind of want to dip in, in a little bit of everything, so it, it works out. And I'm enjoying both, and I, I don't want people to think that I have like to completely like thrown my solo stuff in the trash, and I'm like, right. EDM, all I do is yeah. dance all the time. Um, but I, I definitely, uh, I'm nurturing both, or, or trying to at least, uh, which has kind of been a challenge, but I, I enjoy what I'm doing right now, so I'm, I'm thankful. That's cool. What do yeah. we need to know about... 2013 for you records touring. Um, yeah I'm gonna do I'm gonna be doing a little couple one-off things uh, for right now I will be in Canada um, doing a production kind of I don't know if I'm supposed to say this but whatever uh, with Dancing with the Stars uh, in Canada which will be fun and then kind of a couple things during the summer um, as far as music um, I'm thinking about putting out like an EP of like stripped down of like not Angel Taylor hits, but like just the songs that some that were on Love Travels, some that are new, and kind of putting it on iTunes and see what happens with it. So, yeah. It sounds like you're pretty accomplishing things and, and pretty chill at the same time. Totally. Try to, try to balance both. You know, nice. balance is key in life. Balance is key. And for the maybe two people out there who aren't <laughs> familiar with your music, could you please tell them yes. where to find out more on the interwebs um, about Angel Taylor? Angel Taylor can be found on Facebook, probably. The easiest and quickest, um, Instagram, obviously, my name is Angel Sapphire. Um, what other ones are there? Social medias. Twitter is A Taylor Music. iTunes, Love Travels, my motion EPs on there. Um, and all new stuff will be kind of sporadically mentioned on all of those social networks. Very cool. So. Where are you the mayor of on Foursquare, though? Anywhere? No. No? You got to no. become the mayor of somewhere. I know. I got to work on that. That's my next thing. That's 2013 goal. Right on. Totally. New social media. Done. Square. <laughs> Angel Taylor, thank you for coming. Thank you for having it's me. It's great to finally meet you. It's great to be I've back. so much yeah. about you. It's thank my first you. time to listen in person. Have yeah. a great year. And uh, 
Likewise. See you soon. Thanks. Thanks.